hi guys welcome back so today in this video i will show you how to add social login buttons to your wordpress website so if you are new here please consider subscribing let's get started all right we are on our computer screen just open your browser and log into your wordpress dashboard after logging to your wordpress dashboard just go to plugins click on add new and search for this plugin called super socializer this is the plugin as you can see there are over 60000 active installation just click on install and activate it now our plugin is activated you can see the plugin in the settings just go to social logins and here check mark on this enable social login and this is where you can configure and customize all your settings and here you can select the social networks i will select google and now to get the google client id you need to open a new tab and search for google developer console Select the first option. This will take you to the Google Cloud platform. Just if you haven't logged in, just log in using your existing Gmail account. Just click on select a project and select new project. Give the name to your project. We'll give the name same as my website. And then click on create. This will start creating your project on Google Cloud and select OAuth consent screen from the left and now what I want you to do is select the user type as external and click on create enter your app information here I will enter the app name same as my website and uh, select the support email if you want to set an app logo you can do it from here just scroll down and here in developer contact information just enter your email and click on save and continue here you don't have to change any options just click on save and continue again now go to credentials and click on create credentials select the second option which is OAuth client ID And here select the application type as web application give this web application a name if you want then scroll down and here in authorized redirect urls just enter your website and click on create This will start creating a new client ID that you can use on your WordPress. Our client ID is ready. Just copy this client ID and go back to your WordPress and paste it at Google client ID. Again, copy the client secret and paste it in Google client secret. And then click on save changes. And that's it uh, we are done configuring our google login to our website and now if you want to configure facebook just check mark on this facebook and uh, open a new tab enter facebook for developers select the first result this will take you to your facebook developers page if you haven't logged in just log in using your existing facebook account as I have already logged in, I will click on my apps. As you can see, I don't have any Facebook apps yet. I'll click on create. Select the app type as consumer. And click on continue. Give your app a name. And enter your app contact email. And click on create app. 
it will ask you to complete this capture just complete this capture and click on submit our facebook application is ready now it's time to add products to your application for this demonstration i'm only adding facebook login because that's what we want on our website just select this facebook login and click on setup select the app type as web and enter your website url here and click on save and then click on continue you don't have to worry about this java script and sdk because this is not required we are done adding our product just go to settings click on basic this is where you can change the settings for your facebook application in the app domain just enter your website and here you need to enter your website's privacy policy url if you don't have a privacy policy page on your website i have a separate video for that you can click on the i button on the top and watch it from there so let me enter my privacy policy url and enter your terms and conditions link over here in user data deletion just change this to data deletion instruction url hover over to this i button and click on more this will open a new tab just just copy this url and paste it over here and next you need to select your category i will select my category as education you can select your own category here and if you want to set a app icon you can select it from here i will go ahead and click on save changes now copy this app id go back to your wordpress and paste it in facebook app id same thing with app secret copy this app secret go back to your wordpress and paste it over here and now click on save changes Now switch this to live mode, click on switch mode and uh, your app will start running, your app is now live Just and after that go to Facebook login, click on settings and make sure these two options are on, scroll down and go to valid or auth redirect url just paste this url over here i will give this url in the description your website slash this code and click on save changes now let me show you how to integrate facebook and google on your login page just open your website and go to your login page Click on edit page and here select a new and here select a new block. Click on this plus button and search for short code. Go back to your super socializer plugin and click on short code and visit. Select short code and visit. And here you will get this codes. I will copy this code and paste it on the short code on my website and click on update. Open a new tab and go to your website. Go to your login page. I have these two options now. I can log in using my Facebook and Google. Let me try login using my Google. Enter your Google email and the password and try login using your gmail details and as you can see we are successfully logged in
So this is how it works. You can go to my account and explore more options. And as you can see, we have successfully created an account using our Gmail. And now let's try logging using our Facebook. And this will ask me to continue using as alum. You can click on this and uh, it will log into your website. As you can see, we have logged in using our Facebook. There you go. This is the easiest way you can set up login using your Facebook and Google. If you want more videos on WordPress, I will leave a link in the description. You can also click on this i button on the top and watch it from there. If you found this video valuable, don't forget to give a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.